Hello everyone! Today we're going to be taking a look at Cape Coral, Florida. This town has experienced a great deal of growth over the past few years, and we're going to see if we can find out what exactly makes this town so appealing. Let's get started! Perhaps its most unique trait, Cape Coral is known as the Waterfront Wonderland due to its 400 miles of navigable waterways. The city has more canals than any other city in the world, including Venice, Italy. The city was founded in 1957 by brothers Leonard and Jack Rosen, who purchased the land from a cattle rancher for $678,000. The area was harsh and swampy before the brothers developed it, but after a massive advertisement campaign, they managed to turn it into a thriving community and a coveted living place. Today, the city has more than 30 parks and recreational areas. The city also has a thriving art scene, with several galleries and art shows throughout the year. The city's annual Christmas Boat Parade is one of the largest in the country, featuring boats decorated with festive lights and decorations. Cape Coral is home to several nature preserves, including the Four Mile Cove Ecological Preserve and the Matlacha Pass National Wildlife Refuge. The city's annual Cardboard Boat Regatta challenges participants to build boats out of cardboard and race them in the canals. There is also a coconut festival, which features carnival rides, live music, and a coconut-themed food court. The city's annual Bike Night event features live music, food vendors, and a motorcycle show. Cape Coral is home to a large population of burrowing owls, and the city's official bird is the burrowing owl. Cape Coral has an average temperature of 75.9 degrees Fahrenheit, with an average high of 84.4 degrees Fahrenheit in July, and an average low of 56.6 degrees Fahrenheit in January. The city's annual Cape Coral Irish Festival celebrates Irish culture with live music, food, and dance performances. The city is located on the Caloosahatchee River, which is a popular spot for fishing and boating. The Cape Coral Farmer's Market is held every Saturday and features locally grown produce, handmade crafts, and live music. Cape Coral has a public art program that includes several murals and sculptures throughout the city. The city's library offers a variety of programs and resources for residents, including a makerspace and a genealogy collection. Cape Coral also has a sister city program with Aurence, Spain. Cape Coral has a diverse population, with residents hailing from over 100 different countries and a large Hispanic population, with over 20% of residents identifying as Hispanic or Latino. The city has a robust volunteer program, with opportunities for residents to get involved in community events and initiatives. The town is home to several historic sites, including the Mound House, a location centered on a 2,000-year-old Calusa Indian shell mound. Cape Coral has a strong environmental advocacy community, with several local organizations dedicated to protecting the city's waterways and natural areas. Cape Coral has a public skate park that is free for residents to use. Cape Coral has several pet-friendly parks and beaches, including the Pooch Park at Rotary Park. The city has a strong veterans community, with several organizations dedicated to supporting and honoring veterans. The first bridge connecting Cape Coral to the mainland was built in 1964. Cape Coral also has a public disc golf course that is free for residents to use. Cape Coral has several public tennis courts and pickleball courts. Want to learn more about what it's like living in different places or passing through different experiences? Consider downloading the Lifey app. It's a free library of videos that people have made to share their stories and experiences with others, and you can contribute your own stories as well. We hope you've enjoyed this video and learned something interesting. Thank you for watching!